and welcome to another episode of Driveway Dudes. Today I'm going to show you how to remove tar deposits that have built up on your car, you know, on your bumper, fender, wing or guard, you know, wherever you have the tar deposits. And we're also going to do a small little review on the W5 tar and tree resin remover. Now, uh, William bought that in a well-known German store, Lidl and it costs less than two euro now we're wondering for a product that's less than two euro can it do what it says on the can absolutely and the differences are this comes from an aerosol can whereas a lot of the other ones that i've seen for sale are like a like a cream like a gel that you you know spray or rub onto your bumper onto the tar and then you rub back off again whereas this comes from an aerosol can so we're going to see if it does anything you know for two euro and again, William is going to do all the work. Yeah. Okay, so as we mentioned before, here is the rear bumper on my Citroen C4. As you can see, it's spotted in tar over the years that I've owned it. I've never treated the tar before. And we're going to use, like we mentioned, the W5 tar and tree resin remover. And according to the instructions, you spray the tar and tree resin remover onto the stain and leave the work in. It doesn't say how long, so I'm going to leave it about a minute when I do it. Uh, you rinse the surface thoroughly with water or use an automatic car wash. For tougher stains or where required, repeat. Do not use in full sunlight or on hot surfaces, no worry of that today. For material or painted surfaces, test on an inconspicuous area first. So yeah, um, let's get now, spraying. I've never used this before, no idea what's going to happen. Okay, so I guess now we just leave it a minute. Okay, so the one minute has passed and just like it says on the can, we're just gonna wash it down and uh, let's hope it does something. Okay, um, well, it has appeared to do a small bit. It's slightly better than it was now. I've owned this car for three years and I can guarantee you that it's at least three years of tar. Um, so it has removed it a small bit, but like it says on the can, for tough areas, repeat. And that's what we're gonna do, but the next time after I spray it and leave it a minute, I'm actually going to rub it in using some paper towels. Okay, so um, I was just trying to pat it down to get some rid of some of the water before we started filming again. And it's actually started to rub some of the tar, which means that the residue that was left over from hosing is actually eating into the tar, which is actually a really good sign. Um, but like I mentioned, I'm going to spray it on the bumper again, leave it another minute, but this time I'm gonna rub it in using a paper towel. Okay, so I sprayed it liberally that time because I'm working with the water, which might dilute it. So uh, yeah, let's leave it another minute. Okay, so the next minute has passed and you can actually see that it's starting to drip. It's actually starting to eat into the tar. Uh, but this time, I'm just going to use a paper towel. Everybody has paper towels and I'm just gonna rub it in and I'm probably gonna make a big giant burn mess. Well, you can actually see it is, it is working. <laughs> Look at the paper towel. Okay, that's it. All the tar that, uh, you know, we tried to attack along this edge here is all gone. That's actually a bit of a stone chip or rubbed off some sort of car or trolley or something. Um, but yeah, all the tar is gone. Um, just the final step is to hose it down to get rid of any of the leftover residue. I'm just going to spray down whatever is left over. Okay, that's it. It's uh, it's all gone. Okay, and as you can see from the video, uh, it did an amazing job. Now, it didn't do it the first time around. Um, the tar had been building up for about three years, so it's pretty much what I expected, especially for under two euro. But the second time around, you know, following the instructions for tough deposits, you do it again, and then rubbing it in with the paper towels, it actually came up with an amazing result. Very, very, very happy with it. And I would definitely recommend 
the W5 tar and tree resin remover that you can pick up from Lidl. And don't forget to leave a comment, like, share and subscribe. And you can also follow us on Facebook, Twitter, Instagram and Blogger.